Hi, welcome to the AWS Cost Optimization Series. Today, I'm going to talk about how you can use Trusted Advisor for cost optimization. AWS Trusted Advisor is a real-time AWS tool that assists you in provisioning your resources according to AWS best practices. It performs checks to assist you in optimizing your AWS infrastructure, improving security and performance, lowering overall costs, and monitoring service restrictions. Always take advantage of the recommendations given by Trusted Advisor, whether you wish to develop application or as part of ongoing improvement. You can see the categories in Trusted Advisor reflected as five pillars. For each pillar, the check summary includes a roll-up of check status sorted by no problem detected or green, investigation recommended or orange exclamation mark, and action recommended or red. Trusted Advisor has a huge number of checks that can be performed on a variety of services. The checks are based on best practices identified by experts in each AWS service, as well as learning from serving customers over time. For each check, Trusted Advisor provides recommendations typically based on specific resources that are inspected. For cost optimization, recommendations made by Trusted Advisor can help you save money by identifying idle resources or committing reserve resources. At the moment, Trusted Advisor presents 21 cost optimization checks. Let's have a look on the AWS console. To access Trusted Advisor interface, we'll need to type on this search bar, Trusted Advisor. Click the first option, and we will get this check summary dashboard for the different pillars we have covered before. We will click on cost optimization. We will get also an overview of all the actions recommended for cost optimization. As we can see here, we don't have problems detected, but we can navigate through the different cost optimization checks. Some of the most important checks we will get here are EC2 instances, Elastic Cache, OpenSearch, RDS, Creative Reserve Nodes, and Relational Database Reserve Instances as well. We can take a look on the second page here. We can find here idle load balancers. In case we're not using load balancer, we will get a red marker here. In the same case, if we are lower utilizing our EC2 instances, we will get a red marker here. We need to take a look constantly on the Trusted Advisor cost optimization dashboard to check if we need to fix something in order to pass all the checks and get 21 no problems detected here. Thanks for watching. I hope you have learned something new today and see you in the next video.